Okay, guys, it is Thursday. And Thursday is usually a pretty good workout day because there's hardly anybody in my gym. Everybody busts out on Monday and Tuesday, so it's pretty good. But what we're doing today is, instead of doing the pre-gym, which I've been using the last three workouts because I'm stacking it with the post-gym, which are these packets right here if you haven't seen the video. This is the, his pre-workout and his post-workout. It's got two packs that you take in with uh, after your workout. But I'm going to skip this today because I did order this curse stuff when I ordered the, post, the pre and post-gym. So I want to try this today. Uh, what I noticed about the pre-gym for me is it takes a while for it to kick in. I mean, I'm literally, I'll take it, I'll wait 30 minutes, and by the time I get to the gym, it really doesn't start taking effect until about 30 minutes into my workout. Sometimes I need stuff to hit me a little bit harder, a little bit faster. I notice I have a lot of energy with it, but it's not like amplified energy like I got with the uh, hyper, I mean, I'm sorry, the, the vortex. But the vortex, man, I'm bouncing. I mean, it's like boom, 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 boom. This is like I get good sets, I get good reps, and I steadily go through the workout without a problem. But it's not, you know, sometimes I just want to be kind of jazzed up just a little bit more than, than what this gives you. But this, what's great about the post-gym or the pre-gym, my, my fault, is all the good stuff it gives you inside. All the vitamins, all the beta alanine, the, uh, the acetylene mouth. Hold on, hold on. I'm being too loud. Well, it, it's nothing different than what's going on at your house, buddy. Because every night I wake up, I'm hearing your noise. I'm hearing screaming. I'm hearing yelling. And you got to talk to me about what I'm doing right now? You know, no, no. See, I don't call anybody on you. I don't call you when your house is going up in flames and you're screaming and yelling at your kids or whatever, man. I, oh, that's your daughter. Yeah, well, I mean, can you keep her quiet every now and then? Sometimes I'm studying right now, I'm doing a video, and you're calling me about me being too loud talking on this? I know one thing, buddy. You better shut that raggedy-ass baby up! All right, so back to the post gym, man. The reason I like it really good is all the stuff it gives you inside of it. Because you're not going to get that out of the one MR Vortex. It's got a... It's got the caffeine and everything, but it doesn't have the BCAs that you get, you acquire out of this, and the Bioprint and the Hypersim and you know the extra stuff that this will give you. This definitely does give you energy. Now going over the uh, the Curse it has a very small profile, so I know the uh, the blends are really large. So I see this one Energized Muscle Fuel Blend. It's got 3,030 milligrams of this beta alanine, creatine monohydrate, and cit citrul acid. That's a lot. I mean, it doesn't tell you how much caffeine you're getting. I mean, creatine that you're getting, but it's in that blend. It also has caffeine and hydrous, olive leaf extract, and that has uh, 147 milligrams. And the blood flow amplifier is probably going to give you that pump. It's got the citrusine, citrulline malate arginine and alpha well, let's just say AK AAKG let's just say that because I ain't gonna try to pronounce that word let's go over the directions real quick and I, when I read this it was kind of funny because they say you can take up to three scoops on here so it must not be that potent but it says shake container well before mixing one to three scoops with five to eight ounces of water uh, drink 20 to 30 minutes before your workout or before action Read thoroughly, never use three, more than three scoops in a day. Curse, pre-workout, you know, 50 grams, dietary supplement, green apples, the envy flavor. Let's crack this thing open. Like I said, this is the trial size. Kind of like that, so if you don't like it, you didn't spend too much money, bodybuilding.com, I got this for like eight bucks. So, as you can see, it's just a trial size. Not bad. Kind of looks like the G8 stuff when I got that. Let's see, the scoop size, one scoop is five grams. Serving containers, 10. I'm honestly, man, tempted to take two of these right, right now because I want to get jazzed up, man, but I don't want to go overload. So we're going to do two scoops on the first try. Let's do that. So, that one scoop in there. Do them back today, and I might do just uh, some abs, too. One scoop. And I don't know how large it's going to be here. Let's go two scoops. 
I already took my post pre-workout shake, which was just basically this protein here. I'm using Elite XT because it's got this slow release, fast release, medium release protein. So hopefully it'll be feeding me through the workout. But good price on this, tastes good. You can't go wrong with the XT, man. Back to the uh that's the wrong cap. Yeah. Also, another thing happened today, man. One of my buddies from work, he's been there for about 10 years. See? It's that damn next door neighbor. Anyway, been there for about 10 years. His name's Corey Wilt, man. Wanna wish you all the best. He's moving up to Chicago. Uh, hope we keep in touch, man. He's been my buddy since, you know, not since he started, because when we started, we kind of butted heads, but we, we got on track, man. Really gonna miss the dude. Shout out to this boy named John Mitchell, man. He used to work with me. He died uh, Saturday. Just want to give a shout out to him. We were cool for a long, long time. Uh, I'm sorry about his passing, but just want to shout him out too. Smells good. Green apple. Mm. That tastes rather good, guys. Actually, it tastes real good. Can't say nothing wrong with that. So what I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna take my shaker cup and do what I did on the last video. Just put my pre and my post gem mix into there. So when I'm done with my workout, I'll just mix it with the rest of my water and you go ahead and drink it down. And then an hour after that, I'll take another post-workout shake just to keep those uh, aminos and stuff going. I'm gonna let y'all know how this works. Tony couldn't be there today. He said he might be there this weekend. Hopefully I can get some videos up. I know I've been saying that a lot. But hey, man, I mean, it is what it is. I can't do it by myself. I tried. God joked me because I was deadlifting. I said 290, man. That was actually 310. I mean, I messed up. That was my bad. He called me out. He's like, man, you weak as fuck. But I was like, shh, I counted it wrong, man. <laughs> anyway, we'll see y'all in a little while.